Hello everyone. Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Silent Hill 2. I'm the Black Shadow and uh, after a uh, well not not the not the quickest of starts you may ever see folks. Uh, we are here in the uh, the Woodside apartment blocks folks. Uh, a little bit accidental us actually ending up here. It was a bit inadvertent on our way to the uh, to the Rosewater um Rosewater Park, I think it's called. Yes, that one there, Rosewater Park, folks. Um, but uh, we are here nonetheless. Um, we have uh, we've stumbled our way through here. It's about as good a way as I can put it through. But we've just solved the clock puzzle, and we can now start getting access to some of the areas which were previously, um, no, certainly previously inaccessible to us, folks. So I suggest we get searching. Yeah, a bit of um, a bit of a, a dodgy start. It must be said. Is this the right way? No. Ugh. You ugly bastards. Where are we now? I'm trying to keep track of it. Oh, right, so now in. Oh, I see, so now we're in a, a different stairway. Oh, okay. So that goes to the first, does go to the second, and it also go, it should go to the third floor. Yes, and you remember, folks, we were down there, and there was that key we could get, we could try and get hold of. I think that might. Do we go up or down first? I'm, I'm going to choose up. Um, contrary to my standard way of doing things, I'm going to head upwards first. And I don't know if that's a good sign or not. Oh dear. But yeah, I mean, yeah, we know we at least got handguns. At least we have got the handgun, which we uh, we located inside of a shopping trolley. You know, it just shows you just how easy it is to get firearms in the US. But never mind. But I'm I'm gonna try using this plank a bit more. I really want to try and conserve weapons. Oh, that was a bit that was a bit jerkish. Bit disappointed with that game. Oh, blocked as well. Can I run past? Yes, I can. Oh yeah. Good boss. What in the... What in God's name? Oh, it has been way, way too long, my friend. One of the most iconic... things. I'm not here, I swear. You know, James, you should have turned the flashlight off. Whoa, holy crap! Well, he does appear to have retreated. Whatever that thing was. Oh, I know exactly what that thing was, folks. That is one of the most famous entities, I think, of horror. Of horror gaming. That is possibly one of the most iconic enemies you may ever witness. Courtyard. Key to the door which leads on the west side stairway hall to the courtyard. I don't quite get what that means, but I'll work it out. But that, folks, 
was the pyramid head and it has been a long time since I've been out since we've crossed paths oh boy. bloody hell the um yeah that's not gone too well for those things whatever on earth that even was but uh, at any rate folks we've got hold of a courtyard key not a hundred percent sure exactly what that's for at the moment, but uh, hopefully we can work it out. I have a feeling it might have something to do with this, actually. Ah, it might actually be... Ah, it's that door there, isn't it? Ah, yes. Okay, then. But we're not done here, though, folks. We've got the courtyard key, but we've still got more business to do before we're out of here. Oh, what was that? Did you see that, folks? That wasn't fair. Right, let's turn right here. Remember that key? That key. The fire escape key. And... What the hell? Ooh, hang a bit. Uh-oh. Oh, dear. I can't even see. I... 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 D did I get past it? I don't even know! <laughs> oh, I didn't get past it that time. That was, what are you doing, Shadow? Walked into it. Pretty poor. Please tell me this opens. Please tell me this opens. Thank goodness for that. Yeah, this, um, this policy of trying to dodge things is not working very well. I, um, I... Maybe I need, I need to consider a, a different uh, a different option to this because it's not working well in these confined areas. I need to get back in there because there was a, there was one or two doors. Three oh three, didn't get a chance to see if that actually worked. I, I kind of feel obliged to go back and check, but I'm I'm gonna leave it be. I'm gonna. Say discretion being the better part of valor, I'm gonna leave it be and hope that there wasn't like something massive in there. If there's something comparative to the game, then there's something comparative to the game, and we'll go back and we'll and we will, um, you know, we'll go and get it. But as it stands, I'm gonna leave it. There we go. That's now unlocked, so we can return the way we came. What's that? Got some canned juice. A six pack of canned juice. It was in the hallway on the first floor. Canned juice. Alright, we also got this as well. The fire escape key. Uh, a door leads to the, to the hallway to the fire escape. It says fire escape. There was a fire escape on the far end, while far west end of the second floor hallway. So lots of keys we can start using here, and some canned juice. And no, folks, not really sure why I've got some canned juice. I'm uh, still trying to work that one out just a little bit. So we've got the key to the courtyard, which is all well and good. We've got a fire escape key, which is for that door on the left side, that one. We've got that thing there, which we need to investigate, the, the, the garbage. Was there anything else? I think that was about it. Uh, there was room, like I say, there was room 303, but I'm gonna... I'm gonna hope that it was actually locked, and I can't get into it. I, I, I'm gonna have to hope. And I'm hoping someone here is going to say, great decision, Shadow, because that door's actually locked. If someone can even remember if it was locked. There might be a case, if you can't remember it being locked, odds are you, you know, then there probably wasn't anything in there, you know. If you can remember, remember it being open, then it was something important. If you can't remember it, you know, it being open, then, then it was probably locked. 
there's probably nothing of interest. So, if that made any sense whatsoever to you guys, you know, send me send me some mail. Let me know. Right, so we use the courtyard. Can you just have open that up? But I'm gonna. No. I'm gonna do. I am gonna do the courtyard first. Then we'll head into the next building. We'll clear this place out first. Take this up to the second floor if possible. Welcome to the courtyard. Don't really know what to expect here, but uh, there's a bit of a uh, bit of space to move around here, which is good. That didn't take long, did it, folks? I think we basically have to assume anywhere we decide to walk is likely going to be infested. I think that's just going to be sort of standard protocol from now. Yeah, look at you stuck in there in the swimming pool. Bastard. Really, I can't go that way. Ah, that's not fair. They're trying to spray me from in there. What a bunch of jerks. What's up with that, folks? What is up with that? Are you seeing this? And what the? There is something around here, right? Am I just being really daft, missing something blatant? Or am I just being silly? There's something there, I'm not seeing it. So I'm going to go on the basis that there is nothing there and I'm... What just happened there? Did I just get caught in the back? That was a bit... Come on, that was a bit unfair game. I was in the menu for God's sakes. A little bit upset with that. Uh, well, if there's anything that I do need to do in there, then I honestly don't know what it is at the moment. But we'll we'll work it out later on. Oh, that's bad sound. And of course, I continue to press the wrong button. Which is obviously, becoming much more prevalent throughout the course of this Let's Play series. Right. That's not right. I don't know what direction that is. Not really a direction. Game, this isn't right. I'm I'm a little upset by that. I I have been harshly dealt with. Oh my god. Well, <laughs> thank god that's open. Thank the heavens that it was open. Can you hear that? Ooh dear. Hello? Oh God! For the, for the love of God! Oh man, that was a that was a sight we didn't need to see. It wasn't me. I didn't do it. Do what? I didn't do anything. Nothing outside. Swim. He was like this when I got here. My, uh, my name's James. James Sunderland. Um, Eddie. <laughs> Eddie. Who's that dead guy in the kitchen? I didn't do it. I swear I didn't kill anybody. You're not friends with that red pyramid. <laughs> you gotta be kidding me, right? Red pyramid, <laughs> hey. I don't know what you're talking about. Honest. I did see some weird looking monsters. They scared the hell out of me, so I ran in here. <laughs> well, I guess 
this place isn't too safe either. What happened here anyway? Uh, I, I told you, I don't know. I'm not even from this town. I just, I just... Can a man vomit that much? You too, huh? Something just brought you here, right? Uh, yeah, you could say that. Well, whatever it is, I think you better get out of here soon. <laughs> Easier yeah, said than done. You're right. What about you? I'll leave as soon as I'm done here. Eddie, be careful. James, I... I, um, you be careful, too. <coughs> oh, Eddie, when he's not throwing up in a toilet, he is, uh, an interesting little character. We will obviously come to, uh, learn a little bit more about him as we, uh, as we go on along our journey, folks. The lock's obviously broken. How much hangar do we have? Ooh, that's not that's not too shabby. Right, so what are we gonna do coming out of here? I don't think I'll, I'll chance in hell of running past. We've got lots of ammo, we've got very little health. I think there's only one winner here. Love it. Hate this game sometimes. Oh my god. We are in trouble. Doesn't have to be this way. Kick. Kick and run. Goodness sakes. That doesn't exist. Oh, that's going to prove interesting. Trying to get out of there in a moment. Uh-oh. Load. Oh, come on now. That's not fair. Can't even see. Sit. The fuck down. Oh, that was close. When you've had enough. When you've had enough. Goodness sakes. That makes me feel a little bit better. I mean, I, m maybe it's just me. But I, I, I don't think I'm going to get particularly far um, trying to uh, use the plank. Especially not in areas like this. I think it's going to be not impossible. Was that it? Was that really it? What a waste that was. No, I'm not happy. Right, we all turn immediately right. Oh, like that! Get in! Oh, dear, I didn't expect it to be locked. Bloody Nora. Well, the important thing is we made it out, which has got to count for something. So we're back on the second floor. So we want to head on. Oh, oh what am I doing? Got no idea about any of that that courtyard, folks. I if if there, I, I, maybe there is something there, but I don't know what it is yet. Who knows? So we're going to head this way. We're going to make our way over to the uh, to the fire escape. So we have to be cautious. Have we looked on the? We've looked everywhere on the uh, the left side of all this, haven't we? Yeah, we we, we go there on the um, the floor. 
Should we get this to the far right side? Just see if we we explored it all, didn't we? Yeah, we did. So we're gonna have to head back through here. Head back through the um, the clock puzzle um, opening. Is in here, wasn't it? That's the one. What's up with the music? Yeah, we know this guy's dead. We're aware of this. Game. What are you playing at? Oh, come on! Oh, yeah, how about that? Caught trying to kick the damn thing. Oh, what a dodge there. I want to test something here. This thing here. What if, and this is a bit of a crazy if, is the purpose of this just to, because it's heavy? Ah, oh, look at this! Ha <laughs> ha, yeah! And that was, that was a crazy dodge! That was another crazy dodge! Look at us go! <laughs> you thought I played this game before. Well, I tell you what, we better go down and have a look what's in there. Whatever it was, it was pretty heavy. Just had a fever. I was thinking cans. I mean, six pack. You know, that's got a bit of weight to it. It was. I don't know. Maybe it was something I I, I remember in the back of the head. I don't really know, but it seemed kind of a bit logical, anyways. So the important thing is what fell down. Guys, bags, torn on, concert strewn over. Got a coin of an old man. The police announced today that Walter Sullivan, who was arrested for the 18th of this month for the brutal murder of Billy Locaine and his sister Miriam, committed suicide in his jail cell early on the morning of the 22nd. According to the police statement, S Sullivan used a soup spoon to stab himself in the neck, severing his cat his um. Carotid, oh goodness sake, Shadow, artery. By the time the guard discovered him, Sullivan was dead from blood loss. The spoon buried two inches in his neck. An old schoolmate of Walter Sullivan's from his hometown of Pleasant River said, "He didn't look like the type of guy who would kill kids." But I do remember that just before they arrested him, he was blurting out all sorts of strange stuff, like, "He's trying to kill me. He's trying to punish me." The monster, the red devil. Forgive me, I did it. But it wasn't me. Schoolmate then added, I guess now I think of it, he was kind of crazy. <laughs> well, super. And for our troubles, we have got hold of this. A large coin imprinted on with the face of an old person. Let's get the trash chute exit. Looks like an old man. And is that Greek around the edge? Just as a, a note. Hi, Mary. Uh, nah, I'll, I'll deal with you later. Should I, um, should I, uh, heal a bit? No, we can't. We've only got a first aid kit. <laughs> oh, so we, we're going to have to start being more aggressive here. I, I'm trying to be way too passive, and I'm getting caught out for it. It's too early in the game to be trying to be as clever as I am. I, I think I'm causing my own problems here. But we, either way, we've got the fire escape key, so I suppose we'd best go and use it. Oh, yes! We are learning. James, please. It's a long way down, but, I mean, come on. 
Oh. Well, yeah, there's a window, isn't there? Right, okay, if there's no fire escape, fine, but... No window will do. Won't it? I mean, if there had been a fire in the, in, the, in, the, in the apartment, you'd now be alive, James. So don't go blaming the creators. How ungrateful. No wonder you're here in Silent Hill getting tormented. Because of a freaking fire escape. What's wrong with you, man? And the game's not going to give us a map for the area. Fine. Nothing there. There's a what? It looks like there's something stuck inside the toilet. For goodness sakes. James, I don't know how you can work that out just by looking. But you're clearly a better man than I. It's a wallet. Some kind of memo. Okay. Clearly, that's important for something in a little bit. Ooh. A health drink? Always take health drinks. Oh, wait, no, no. Don't want to go out yet. No, 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 no. No, 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 not with that freaking sounds out there. Oh, it's caught James's eye. Ah. It's a safe. Hmm. What was it there? Is it numbers varying around here? Between 1 and 20, I think that is. Hold on a second. Now we all know how safes work, don't we, folks? The way to unlock them is you've got to go from set numbers. You've got to go left, right, left, right, left, right, that sort of thing. I bet you. Yeah, look at that. There's a clue there as well. So, we go to 5. Right, X4. Left to VV1 and right to X16. X and V, no, it's, it's obviously not, it's not some kind of formula. X and V, X and V, X and V. Roman numerals? 5, 14, 16, 5, 5, 1, 11? Well, they're all beneath 20, so... Might, might be in the right neck of the woods. So, 5, right to 4... So, right, so we're going to... So, 5, right 14... Left 11, right 16. So, 5... So, we got to go right. Remember the first... So, 5, 14... So, 5, 14, 11, 16. Okay. 5, 14, 11, 16. Okay, then. So... Five. Five, so we go right. Fourteen. Left to eleven. Right sixteen. Ah. Let me guess. It's not the number you go to, it's how many times you go by. So we start, alright, we'll go 5, so 5, 14, 11, 6, so right 14. So we'll count them. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Left 11. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. This is probably going to come out slightly out of sync on the actual recording. I do apologise because of the way I record. Right 16. Hmm. 
no. VV1 I surely it's Roman numerals. Surely this is Roman numerals X and V's but VV1 What's VV? V's 5 but VV 51 I don't know, what's VV? V is 5. X is 10. C is 100. M is 1,000. I think it's that way around. VV. What's VV? Come on, Shadow. I mean, come on. You, 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 you did part of Roman history... You you played the deaf Rome Total War. You've dealt in Roman numerals. You've done maths equations in Roman numerals for the hell of it. You should know what VV is. Come on, VV. Uh, uh. VV. It's got to be 5 plus 5. Surely it's 10. So it's 11. Right? Surely. Yeah, V, V is 5, 5, which is 10. Unless maybe I'm just going the wrong way about it, perhaps. I mean, if it's, uh... Oh, look at that. It's on 4. Why is that? Is it random? Is it because I've stopped on 4? Maybe it is. Alright, okay, so let's go to... Let's go here. Okay, so, right five. We'll go from one. No, we'll go... No, we'll do it from five. It starts at five. So, right sixteen. I'm going to do it by numbers again. So, we'll go... So, turning it right... No, it's not sixteen. It's fourteen, isn't it? Left eleven... Now I can't even remember numbers. Right? This is probably looking a this is probably looking a bit embarrassing. It, it, you know, it's gotta be people shouting at the screens. No, Shadow, you gotta do this. You're doing it wrong. What's up, review? You surely you should be blitzing this, and maybe I I should. Maybe you're right, but uh, I'm having a bit of a silly moment here. Right, fourteen, left eleven, right sixteen. It starts at five. Or maybe I'm doing the the buttons the wrong way round. Five. Right to fourteen. Left to eleven. Right to sixteen. Yes, there we are. I just do it the wrong way around, folks. Do apologise. Got some handgun bullets. Handgun bullets. Handgun bullets. Wow, four handgun bullets for that. Nice. Yeah, I'm just going the wrong way around it, folks. I do apologise. We we had the the right idea. It's just yeah, I was getting my lefts and rights a bit um bit mixed up there. Right. Okay. So we need to head this way, and this place is going to be not fun. Ooh, that's not a bad um, technique. You stay the fuck down. It's not a bad idea, that actually, folks. You've seen that. I, was, I just you, you shoot and just stun them so you can run past, maybe. You, I can just run past because you're pathetic.
Right, okay, so where the hell are we, folks? That's the question. Staircase? Ah! Map! Ah, yes! That's important. Right, so let's figure out what the heck have we actually done. Okay, so we've come from the... Ah, oh, that's quite clever. Let's put the um, let's put the two together now. That's quite a nice touch. So we've got two separate staircases on the... Uh oh, that's wrong. So that's the first floor. That's the second. And that's the third. That's a nice touch. So, if we um, head back out, there's a door on the right, apparently, I've, I missed. And then we'll continue. We'll go to the second floor first, and I'll head to the end, and we'll head up or down. I haven't really decided. I'm not seeing a room, but I'll check, anyways. No, Shadow, wrong button. Oh, goodness. This <laughs> is so annoying. I. No. No. <laughs> Thanks, game. Works. The system doth work. Right, that's nothing there. What's that? Dear Tim, I have a, a run errand, so I'm going to run out. And I've got the clear case! I don't know what the rest of it said. Oh, goodness sakes. Locked as well. There's room near the first place staircase. I didn't catch the rest of it. Ah! Uh, uh, so annoying! So brutally annoying. Uh. I didn't realize the game carries on. I left the house key with Uncle David. The key is in the room near the first floor staircase. I'll be back as soon as I can, so please watch the place while I'm gone. Disaster that. Right, we are now out of health, folks. That is a horrendous spot that we've ended up in. It's my own bloody fault. Suppose we go first floor then. Oh, there's two doors. Was that back alley? Well, whatever it is, it don't work anyway, so. Right, we are now on just aggression mode now. No more fucking around. Right, I pretty want to go first then that way. Mother. No. 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 But you obviously didn't catch the memo when I said no more fucking around. That means you die. I'm not getting, I'm not really getting much of a luck of the draw here at the moment, am I, folks? Not a lot really worked itself out. Look, that's handy. That's, uh, no, that is a result. And I have a nasty, nasty feeling this place ain't going to be safe.
Oh shit, Miss Press. Oh, for good goodness sakes. Now I'm trying to give myself a heart attack. Well, there is a save point here, though. Which I am going to make use of. I'm going to save the game, and I think that's probably... Probably where I'm going to bring an end to this video, folks, uh, as we are here. We made it into the West Apartment Building, which is good. Um, lots of hand glamour, which is good, but we are rapidly, rapidly running out of health, and I am not helping the situation at all, folks. Um, I'm sorry, but I, I, I think help. I don't know what's more important in this game: health or handgun bullets. Hmm, there's a, uh, there, there's one for you to ponder. Well, as it is, folks, that's where I'm going to bring this, uh, this, this uh, video to an end. So, oh, thank you very, very much for watching. Next time, we will be continuing through the apartment building, trying to find Timmy's key. Um, and trying to get the heck out of this damn place. Oh, I hate this apartment. I want to get out of here. I want to get to Rosewater Park. Where we're supposed to be going anyways. Why did I have to come in here? Oh. I'll see you next time.